Let me tell you, how dare you get into bed with Bill Gates? Shame on you, Androlness. Warg one people, flame them and shame them. You see, flame tight, no man coming up in this video. Prime Minister Olness get bash. A lady exposed Prime Minister Olness saying that allegedly him and Bill Gates go lie down and do things you don't know me and talk right here. So, and also, she exposed Prime Minister Olness and him wickedness where him do to the Jamaican kids them. Police constable arrest following firearm ammunition seizure. Sentence police investigating teenagers death. People, I know you don't want to miss out on these topics so please don't go away. If you have viewed the channel for the first time, please subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, leave a like on this video, leave your thoughts in the comment section. Stay tuned. Do you believe that the creators of these products really want to kill all insects and make them extinct? Well, personally, I don't believe it because if that was the case and all the insects should die and become extinct, then there would be no need for these products anymore. And those persons who create these products would be sending themselves into unemployment. So think about it. What I do know about these products, you have to keep them as far as possible out of the reach of children. You have to be very careful with them. Observe, they can start a very big fire. And the fire can easily destroy your house and make your house extinct. So be careful, people. The sentence Bay police have yet to make a breakthrough in the murder of a teenager whose body was discovered with gunshot wounds on Thursday. The deceased was identified as Nicholas Strata, 15 year old of Lily Valley and Windsor Senton. It's reported that the body of the teenager was found in bushes in the Laughlands community in the parish about 8.30 a.m. Thursday. The police were called and the team which responded observed what appealed to be gunshot wounds to the head of the teenager's body. Wow, me I tell you, you know, be things are going on in Jamaica. A police constable has been arrested and charged with illegal possession of firearm and ammunition following the seizure of a Glock pistol and an assortment of ammunition on Friday, October the 28th. According to reports, lawmen received information around 1.30 p.m. of a group of men who had a firearm and were acting suspiciously at the Swallowfield Island Traffic Authority Examination Depot in Kingston. The lawmen following the tip went to the location where the four reportedly suspect men were seen. They were accosted by the police. The police said that while searching the men, one gold and black Australia Glock 9x19, a fix with magazine was removed from the front of one of the men's pants waist. The man then identified himself to be a police constable stationed at the Era 5 headquarters. The police constable then escorted to the Jamaica Constabulary Force Operation Branch, where the firearm was reportedly examined and found to contain a magazine with 15 rounds of ammunition and one in the chamber. There was no serial number on the weapon, the police reported. The police said that a further search of the police constable resulted in confiscation of one 9mm rounds which was found in his right front jeans pants pocket and one black firearm oster which was taken from the front of his pants waist. Further investigation was carried out at the police constable home, where he handed over a pair of brown clock shoes with the right foot containing one M16 magazine with 30 rounds, and the left foot containing one brown paper bag with 14 live and 3 blank 5.56 cartridges. A paper bag with 15 9mm cartridges and a clear plastic bag with two 12 gauge cartridges and one M16 blank and one 22 cartridges were also seized. The police reported that a number of accoutrements which included a firearm, oster, button and carry-on were also taken for self-keeping pending outcome of investigation. Judge a god people, mo want to talk to me in the comment section. Wanna say if a police officer get caught with them thing there, worse a man of the system get caught with illegal something. Talk to me. Wanna say for them charge for double up. Judge a god. 
that I go hurt up them events because in a real life so you can't be la man and at the end of the day you I do the wrong hmm? me not, it not add up it don't add up one bit people make a reason in the comment section about this situation People a video circulate social media with a white lady and watch ya, me not attack the one where you go sniff up you know. No, me not play the game there. Me attack person. So people, the video circulate social media and the lady a expose Anjo Olness. Mm -hmm. The woman attack up some crocus bag of things. Me not know if she insane or she can connect to us what she has said. I go and play the video and we have a reason in the comment section. I want to talk to me. Do you agree with what she has said or you don't agree? Right now this is a really urgent message. I just got some really horrible news and I'm about to show you a video that is despicable. This is not Obia. Obel in high school has been signed up by a mandate from the Jamaican government for the children to go through the experimental vaccine. When you do experiments, you have a test group and you have the real Mackay. Half those students will have been given saline for the test group and the other half will have been given the real Mackay. And I am about to show you. And I, pre I want you to be very, very prepared for this. Because these are children in Jamaica right now that this morning have received an mRNA technology bioweapon. It does not stop the transmission. Why are you still pushing it, Andromus? Look at what you have done. These are children. <laughs> This is not Obia. These are children dropping down from this vaccine. Shame on you, Andrew Olness. Let me tell you, how dare you get into bed with Bill Gates? Shame on you, Andrew Olness. You need to go to prison for genocide. <laughs> Hey, that's 